Hello everyone, the following video will give you some ideas on how to annotate a book without writing in the book directly. I have three simple straightforward ways, so let's get started. I'll also be sharing the pros and cons for each of these just in case. My first tip is to use sticky notes. Sticky notes are a good option if you still wish to physically write on paper. Your thoughts on the passage can be expanded within the note and placed on the relevant page. The good thing about this method is that oftentimes there's not enough space on the margins of a book to fully flesh out your thoughts, but sticky notes offer more space and there's no concern of messing up your writing because you can easily replace it with another one. The problem with this method might be that when the time comes to remove the sticky note, it might leave a sticky residue on the page that ruins it. Additionally, it could be annoying to constantly flip up the sticky note in order to look at the writing under it. There's also the possibility of losing the sticky note. The second tip involves using an external notebook. This is another option for those who still wish to physically write. You can reference the relevant page, passage, author and title of the text on the notebook beside your thoughts. Again, this offers another solution to not alter your actual book and offers more space to flesh out your thoughts. The problem with this method is that it isn't very convenient. Sometimes it's helpful to flip through all the pages of a book and actually see the surrounding passages within the words that stuck out to you. But that's not possible in this case without also having access to the book. This is easily solvable if you have the e-version of a text because then you constantly have access to your library wherever you go. The last option is probably the most convenient one and it's to note your thoughts in regards to events and passages of the text on a table. This can be done through Notion, Word, or Pages. The columns can consist of genre, title and author of the book, relevant passage, and thoughts. The pros of this method is that typing notes is easy. Sometimes with physical writing, your pen can't move as quickly as your mind works, but with typing, you are able to type out your thoughts as the ideas come. Additionally, you can easily search through your notes and find a reference without the effort of flipping through a book. I really hope that this was somewhat helpful and good luck.